This is black birch.
400, 100. <clears throat> and different types work better than others too, so <clears throat> I'll just start it. I gotta oil this up. Kind of cockeyed a little bit, but it doesn't matter. Birch. Got my walrus oil. Chase them down. But uh, functional, not perfect. I don't wanna take the fun out of it. But uh, that's what we're doing. And this is soaking pretty fast this walrus oil then I'll finish it up with some Howard's uh, butcher board conditioning and if you're home you can use uh, some olive oil to maintain some spoons but uh, dip that in there Ooh. but uh, yeah I just filmed you know some of making this but uh, get it going so I can't start to see but there is a little bit of green in there somewhere I don't know if you can see it the lighting's not that good there but there is so really soaking in fast so I'm gonna put this here and this is uh, another bird spoon I made uh, yesterday yeah I think it was yesterday but uh, I finished it yesterday but uh, a little lighter a little thinner um, yeah, right for your haversack or whatever but uh, fin finished it with some Howard's but then what I do but nice and practical you know I mean it's, it's fine wanted to see what cottonwood would do you know good enough but uh, so I just rub it on the outside there but when you have some old ferro rod and uh, that's what we're doing here I just uh, filmed all this just for the hell of it and uh, just give you an idea of some of the stuff that goes on and this is birch it's kind of not too hard not too easy it depends and uh, pine's easier but you have to make sure it's not too you have to be careful with the wood whether it's too dry or it's too seasoned and no matter what you're working with so but when I got stuff on my hands, I'll rub it on some of my other stuff here. But I got a whole bunch of stuff over there. Spatulas, spoons, everything. So, been making them. Two days in a row, made a spoon. But, uh, cool. Gonna ask for a fair ride. Take care. No cuts.